Just give this a few minutes here till uh, some people can come along. Let me just check and make sure that we're on. Okay. We're just on. give this a few minutes here till uh, some um, people can come along. Not going to be a very long live stream. I just wanted to do this very quickly. Just check and make sure that we're on. Okay. We're just on. give this so, a few minutes here till uh, some um, people can come along. Like I said, not going to be a very long live stream. Just I just wanted to do this very quickly. Know. Check and make sure that we're on. Live okay. stream going on. Just give this a few minutes here uh, till uh, tuning in. Um, people can come yeah. along. Like I said, not going to be a very long live stream. Okay. I just wanted to do this very quickly. Else. Check and make sure that we're on. Live stream going on right now. The ceiling. Give this a few minutes here till tuning in. People can come along. Like I said, not going to be a very long live stream. I just wanted to do this. But just going to be doing a little live stream right now. The ceiling. I saw this later in the day. Tuning in. People can come along. It's not going to be a very long live stream. I just wanted to do this. But just going to be doing a little live stream right now. A lot of echo. I saw this morning. I saw this morning. Come along. It's not going to be a very long time. I just wanted to do this. But just the going to be doing a little live stream. Stop like that. And then I'll try it again. I'll share screen. Um, okay. Is that better? Do it this way. Okay, is that better now? Does that sound better? Does everything sound good? I see a couple of you are saying better. Okay, I think I had I had another screen open and I, I was doing a, a share audio, so that was the problem. Okay, a little technical difficulty there, but um, just real quick here, I saw this the other day and I was on Amazon and I thought, I wonder how many people made, you know, reviews of my book or whatever else and so i clicked on this my book right here as you can see and um there's my book 27 ratings and i went down through here to look at the ratings and um where's that and i saw this and i thought what <laughs> and uh so i clicked on this you can see here's my book with this lighter thing on it and uh, a bunch of sticks in this fire pit thing. Um, what's in the writer's heart? Like they could possibly know that. Uh, the Bible says, for out of the abundance of the heart, the mouth speaketh. Yeah, I wrote a book about Jesus, about the Godhead. Luke 6, 45b, the writer is a condescending man at heart. You know that, you know, she knows me personally. This Natalie Elizabeth Bartram or whatever. Clearly, clearly, he is not a proper writer. The overuse of the exclamation point is just as bad as the amount of rainbow flags at a pride parade. Uh, he is constantly hitting the caps locks to yell. I wonder if God is pleased with this work at the hands of Mr. Denlinger. Uh, I'm sure he is because it's about him. Um, the writer also explained that he did not write about everything that he knows on this topic, even though he is aware there's more. He states that things are clear, yet he twists scripture or doesn't even use any. Um, <clears throat> he does not seem to allow anything else other than agreeing with him or you are rejecting the Lord Jesus Christ. Well, I do not think I agree, but praise God that Mr. Denlinger is not my savior. He's just a man. Well, you know, that is very true. All right. Uh, weird. But let me just explain something. I just wanted to show people this thing because, you know, pretty funny here. but. And I want to say something else about my book being burned, but uh, um, he is constantly hitting the caps locks to yell. Okay, um, let me explain something. I am not a texting kind of a person, okay? I, that's not why I capitalize words. I capitalize words in my writing to emphasize and say, please pay attention to what's being said. Focus in on this key word here. See, I'm from kind of the old generation that I emphasize things by all capital letters. I don't text, so that doesn't mean I'm yelling at anybody, okay? So if you're watching this, uh, Natalie there, uh, I'm not yelling at anybody. I'm just trying to say, pay attention to this word. That's why I would do that in my book. See if I can get an example of this here. Um, 
just have my book right here, a copy of my book. You know, he doesn't doesn't use any scripture at all. Or, you know, sometimes I don't use scripture or something. Um, so, you know, and, and I think Jesus yelled a few times, you know, raised his voice. Um, okay, right there. I'll just show this here. If you can see that created them. Okay, there's an example where I capitalized it because I wanted to make emphasis on one word. I'm not yelling. <laughs> but it's so bizarre to me because um, I heard this years ago, Peter Ruckman, one of his recordings, and he was talking about some students of his, or not some students, excuse me, some young men contacted him from Bob Jones University. They weren't his students, but they were young men that knew about Peter Ruckman, and they said that they were having Ruckman book burnings on campus, burning his books. And I remember he said, it's Catholic. It's a Catholic thing. They're burning a Bible believer's books. You know, I mean, I'm not against book burning. I mean, you burn, you know, occult books, burn new versions, whatever else. That's New Testament practice. But uh, burning a book like this, you know, I'm just thinking, okay, you're not really uh, proving much. So, yeah, but then the other news that just, I just found out about this, date of death, September 8th, 2022. So if you saw my one video I did about the, you know, the media propaganda thing, how they've been planning to cover her death and everything, now we'll see what happens. And it was really weird because I did not make a video about this. I was going to, but I did not make a video. Down at the local grocery store here, just a, you know, two blocks down or something from our office. And I saw this children's book about Queen Elizabeth for sale with all the other children's books. Right there it is. And I saw this thing, you know, all the little golden books. You can see the little golden edge there, you know, the little red caboose and, the, you know, all the little children's books. And I saw this and I thought, a children's book about that woman? You know, I thought, huh? What's that all about? And then I, we were walking back, and I thought, oh, I wonder if she's about ready to die. And they're going to, you know, get these books out there, get them out quick enough so that when she dies and they do the big media coverage thing, then the books will be there on the shelves, and they'll sell like hotcakes. <laughs> so I mean, just terrible to think of that she's going to be used as a media distraction. So very early on this one um i literally just found out about this yeah london bridge is down yeah exactly the code word there um so we will see what happens now with the media uh there's some really bad stuff happening right now with the financial world the supply chain shortage um fuel prices all this other stuff um and they need a good distraction so now We'll see what happens. Okay. Um, yeah. Uh, like I said, I mean, I just literally heard about this probably five minutes ago, 10 minutes ago, whatever else. I mean, I just heard it. I thought, okay, I wanted to talk about the thing of this crazy woman that wants to, you know, burn my book. Uh, you still had to pay me for it. So, you know, whatever. <laughs> um, but I heard, I saw that, and I was going to make a, a live stream, and then I heard about the queen dying, and I thought, oh boy, here we go. Good uh, media distraction. So, um, yeah. So, okay, just wanted to do a real quick live stream here. Um, so, we will see what happens over the next 24 hours. Um, so. Real quick here, I just want to say this. Yes, we did. Um, been really busy. And so today was the day we just went and went to the bank. So thank you. Thank you very much for that. Um, Saw a picture of the queen with her nurse before she died, and the nurse had a, has a belt on with the Freemasonic symbol and a hex on it. Really? That's interesting. 
did you see my comment on your last video? No, I don't think I did. Um, YouTube is, <sighs> it's terrible. I mean, I, they put up some comments and things sometimes and people, did you see my comment? And I go and I have to look for it. No, no, I don't see it. And oh, it's in this hidden thing or whatever else. Um, yeah. Okay. So yeah. So anyhow, I need to get going. I just thought I'd pop in here quickly. Hi to everybody. Oh, one other thing real quickly. Um, let me show this. Uh, one of you had in the last live stream thing I did, um, they have this video here about uh, this um, seven pre-trib problems in the pre-rath rapture full movie. Um, I think what I'm going to do, somebody had told me about this before and I, was, I started watching a little bit and it's just new versions and all kinds of problems. So I think what I'm going to do is I'm going to... Um, probably do a live stream on Sunday morning and we'll just start watching it. We'll see how far we can get into it. I mean, it's two hours and 16 minutes. So I might, you know, just maybe take two weeks to refute it or whatever else, just do half of it and then another half, another week or whatever. Um, so I think I'll probably, you know, do that to answer this stuff right here. Um, so uh, we have a, a bunch of different things going right now. We have this whole Wolfton thing with the mining here in Maine, the meetings tonight. So, um, but I really want to get back to kicking the new versions, and I've been doing some work on that um, as much as I can. And so, um, but uh, I'm going, going to get off here, get going. So. Watch the media firestorm with this whole Elizabeth thing dying. So that is going to be it. And we'll see you in the next video.